voices join tonight to celebrate a century of Dominican faith, commitment, and love, the foundation of this college called Providence. The Dominicans really set the tone on campus. It's really the Dominicans at PC that make PC what it is, that make it unique. Dominicans are at the heart of Providence College, and they always will be. It was the influence of those Dominicans that really kind of changed my life. With four Dominican uncles, including Father Dennis Kane, and a lifetime of connections to Providence College, Maureen Corcoran has a unique perspective. They are the order of preachers. They're preaching from the pulpit and in the classroom, but their most powerful preaching is in the example that they set for us. Seeing Dominicans walking around on campus um, during my time here, it was just a reminder of God's presence among us. The Dominicans humble themselves every day to share in the humanity of all of the students here at Providence College. They've been my teachers, they've been my mentors, my life coaches. They're really invested in our well-being and our growth. The most important question in four years of college is, what did God make me to do? I hope every Dominican with every student that they encounter and develop a relationship is helping that student to answer that question. They ask you advice, or they're just sitting down talking to you about whatever. Builds up a certain trust, relationship, friendship. And then when certain things happen in their life, both here and once they graduate, you become part of it again. Dominicans are on the path of life with you. They bring to the college a great intellectual history, an intellectual focus, but also one that's geared towards truth, but also towards love. Sania Ahmad has experienced Dominican compassion firsthand. A Muslim student from New Jersey, Sadia says her PC experience changed her life. There's a real sense of comfort in knowing that um, we live among a Dominican community that really genuinely cares about all of its students regardless of their background. That's, I think, the heart of really what draws me to the Dominican life, is, is that rich connection between the intellectual life between contemplation and the sharing of, of the gospel with, with God's people. Every time you put the habit on, this on, it reminds you of who you are and what you're about. I think that the presence of Dominicans on campus in very different ways, from the chaplain's office to the president's office to everything in between, is the kind of, I hope, peaceful ballast of what it is to be a community, and that brings people together. And they're that physical reminder of who we are as a college and what we believe in, and most importantly, where we come from and where we're all striving to go. Always pointing and living towards God. They have blessed us, and that special Dominican blessing is something that I think will carry on in each of us for all of our lives. With gratitude beyond words, in appreciation for a century of undying love and steadfast loyalty, Providence College proudly presents the 2016 Black and White Award to its beloved Dominican community. Oh.